my tips to directors on how to disagree without being disagreeable really are in three areas. First, it's in the spirit. Remain curious. Remain open. If you want others to be open to your thoughts, you need to be open to theirs. Second, as you seek to understand in this curiosity, make notes. Take your notes and start to understand the assumptions that were used for the other person to come to their recommendation or conclusion. Isolate those assumptions. Then, if A plus B plus C equals D, if that's the formula, first find the assumptions you agree with and say that. Begin with, I agree with A, I agree with C, I have a different point of view on B. Then isolate that assumption and offer a different perspective. It's in that perspective that you have the ability to disagree without being disagreeable. Then offer another course of action. The course of action may be to table the current motion table the current recommendation until you can get more background on the assumptions, or it may be for you to offer a different course of action. Finally, don't make it personal. Don't make it personal both ways. When you start to own it, then it becomes personal if they disagree. Or when you start saying you and make the other person on it, it becomes personal. Rather, keep it more objective. So, if you will have a good spirit, remain curious, isolate the assumptions and disagree with the assumptions, suggest another point of view or another course of action, and don't make it personal, then you can disagree without being disagreeable.